Well, good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to another episode of Rooftop Rendezvous coming to you live today from the beautiful Lago Mar Beach Resort at the very tip, southern tip of Fort Lauderdale Beach. It is another gorgeous day. We say it all the time, but I think Mother Nature is definitely on our side on Wednesdays, and she certainly has been for the last couple of weeks since spring rolled over on that calendar. It is just perfect, and what an idyllic setting we are in today. You can see that beautiful blue ocean, blue-green ocean, if you can catch that color out there, and the sun in the sky with those Pretty little rolling clouds, but just another gorgeous day. We are up on the fifth floor outside one of the suites, as I said, from Lago Mar Beach Resort, and have a very special guest with us today that we'd love to introduce you to, General Manager Jim Pancalo. Hello, Jim. Hello, Ari. Welcome, everybody, to Lago Mar Beach Resort. A little bit of history about Lago Mar. Uh, we're right on the beach, as you can see behind me, where we have about 500 feet of uh, beach and we're on 10 acres of land. We're owned by the Banks family and uh, we've been privately owned for many, many years. Um, we have everything for everybody here, from families to, to groups to meetings to weddings. Uh, whatever your needs are, Lagomar, we have it here. Uh, all the way from um, you know 15,000 square feet of meeting space to uh, pools, uh, recreation for the kids, and just a, a spectacular view over the Atlantic Ocean. So. Ari? Yes, and it is spectacular. And we are going to let you give us a tour of this beautiful property from this gorgeous room. We are in room 580. 580. Remember that. If you want this view when you're booking your stay here at Lago Mar, room 580 is going to get you this. And we're going to let Jim explain what you are seeing. So again, you see a, a private beach. We're nestled back in our neighborhood just north of Port Everglades. And uh, all these are our umbrellas, our cabanas. Uh, if you pan to the right, uh, you can see we actually have a, a beach basketball court. That is so cool. So for all you outdoor sports enthusiasts, it's not just water sports here at Lago Mar. You can catch a game of uh, beach basketball. <laughs> beach basketball, a little bit to the right of that. You're going to see a couple beach volleyball uh, nets. That there again, we. young and old. And we'll have fun doing. Wow. A little bit beyond that, you're going to see the jetties where all the cruise ships come in. We, all the spectacular uh, private yachts, you'll see them coming out. Yeah, uh, we just saw some beautiful ones that were we coming did. back and forth. We'll, we'll make sure to pan back over when, when another big one makes its way out of there. And I'm sorry to interrupt, yeah. but if you can see that airplane in the sky, that is a Southwest airline airplane we are so close to the airport we're at the Hollywood Fort Lauderdale International Airport it's about um, probably about a 15 minute drive uh, from the airport to Lagomar Beach Resort so land jump in a cab or an uber and you can be here correct awesome okay so now and now you're overlooking uh, uh, one of our pools we have two pools actually on property um, one is a little bit deeper, this pool right here, you just pan to the left, was at uh, nine feet deep, believe it or not, and the one to the right, um, that's called the lagoon pool, a little more shallow for the kids. Yeah, we're going to we're gonna snap some photos while we're here, and you can actually go on to Lago Mar's website, lagomarresort.com. Correct. And uh, check it out, beautiful new photos, and, I, and we hear that there's some more new photos that are going to be placed up there, but what a, what a gorgeous property, and it doesn't end there, so we have... You pan down, you can see two of our beach tennis courts. We actually have four. There's two uh, other, uh, in the other part of the property, but these are right on the beach. And uh, you can see some shuffleboard courts there where, again, young and old like to play. And a little bit to the right of that, you'll see a miniature uh, golf uh, putting green yeah. that some of the kids are playing on right now. Oh, yes. Young and old <laughs> are, are out there. That is just so cool, and I love I don't know if anybody can see it, but we'll we'll snap some pictures too. Yeah, we got shuffleboard here again for young and old. Uh, beyond that, we got a, a foosball uh, they can play. Uh, beyond that is um, is a swing set. We have a beach playground. 
uh, and the ping pong table again, everything's right on the beach here. Yeah. And, and I see some kids playing some chess, yes. some, la some uh, large chess board we have over there, and that always gets uh, played throughout the day. Ah, oh, this is spectacular. I know that Lago Mar has this incredible history of, you know, just generations staying here. So you came with your family as children, you are now bringing your children back. Um, and it really is, you know, for the Fort Lauderdale Beach area, and I think that we're a very fr family-friendly destination, but this just typifies it. Yeah, it's not uncommon to have three or four generations to stay at Lagomar, and I hear the stories all the time where my parents or my grandparents brought me here, or I would learn how to swim here, or I was on the beach here, all kinds of stories, and it's people, again, that have been coming here for years and years and years. It's remarkable. Yeah, it's beautiful, and I think one of the... One of the nice amenities also, for guests that are staying here, you have just a world-class spa inside as well. We have a spa, a nice fitness center. Uh, again, some nice meeting space. We have uh, about four different uh, restaurants here, indoors and out. And uh, all the way from casual, we open up for breakfast, nice buffet, all the way till nighttime, a nice dinner inside, or a casual dinner, lunch, uh, outside around our uh, promenade bar, we call it. And you forgot my favorite place. The soda shop? The soda shop. The soda shop we serve. <laughs> uh, we have a little bit of everything in there. Uh, we have food, we have we serve breakfast, lunch, and dinner. In there there's about a nine seat counter, uh, stools uh, at a counter, and we have everywhere from toys to the beer, to wine, to candy, suntan lotion, of course you need it in uh, Fort Lauderdale, and a little bit of everything in that soda shop. And ice cream! And ice cream! <laughs> a lot of ice cream for the kids. Lots, lots of ice cream. Lots of fun things here. Well. I want to thank you so much for taking time out of your day. I know that it has been just an incredibly busy time for Lago Mar over the Easter holiday and with Tortuga Music Festival. And I don't think you're ever not busy here. We're always busy year round. And come visit us and look at the, again our website. Website it's lagomar.com. It's L-A-G-O-M-A-R.com. And uh, look at our website and uh, hopefully you'll come down to Fort Lauderdale and uh, visit us at Lagomar. We really appreciate it. Oh, well, thank you so very much. We're handshaking behind the camera. <laughs> you can't see, but Jim, is, Jim has been a fixture here on Fort Lauderdale Beach and a number of properties, but I know that this has been his home here at Lagomar for quite some time, and I think you typify what Lagomar is, too. Just a true gentleman, and uh, when you come into it, you just you feel hospitality and it starts from the top down. So I want to thank you for everything that you bring to the Fort Lauderdale Beach community. And uh, we're going to leave. We always talk through these things. I thank you all for your little comments down there. We, um, I forgot at the beginning of our broadcast to welcome all of our new viewers, but everyone's like family now. We're, you're here every week. But if you are new to us on behalf of our beach business community, we really want to welcome you to myfortlauderdalebeach.com and our weekly broadcast here. We are here once a week every Wednesday between 12.45 and 1 o'clock just to give you a little sneak peek of our backyard from a different vantage point and uh, answer your questions that you leave in the comments below or just, you know, let you check out and take a little midweek escape with us overlooking these beautiful, beautiful beach views. So not too much to talk about now so we've got about another five minutes or so and we are just going to leave you with peace quiet tranquil settings we're gonna pop over here maybe and catch one of those boats coming out between the jetties leaving port everglades let you see what you can experience when you are a guest here at lago mar and on fort lauderdale beach
I'll tell you, as we start to wrap up today's broadcast, you can certainly get used to this. What a beautiful view. How relaxing. I could just pop on one of these lounge chairs, open up a good book, and uh, sit here and just soak in this beautiful ocean air. Fort Lauderdale Beach, we have had just a bustling March and early April with so many events and activities take place. And while it's starting to quiet down a little bit, maybe for the next week or two, there is still so much to do around town. I encourage you to visit our website, myfortlauderdalebeach.com and click on that special events tab where you can see some of the upcoming things not only here on the beach, but just down the boulevard a little bit beyond into our theater district area. Everything is just a stone's throw away like our airport, which is just a short 15 minutes. But if you are coming into town over the next couple of weeks, so you're planning that late spring, early summer vacation, uh, next Friday night down on Las Olas Boulevard, so very close to us, is the Las Olas Food and Wine Festival on April 20th. A number of our wonderful restaurants here on Fort Lauderdale Beach are going to be participating as well as a number of restaurants just throughout this immediate area. So if you are a foodie, definitely something for you to enjoy that day and if you are going to enjoy, you certainly want to register and sign up for the 5K on A1A Run, benefiting Covenant House, which is on the north part of the island, on the barrier island here, over by our world-famous Parrot Lounge. Uh, that takes place on Saturday, April 21st. Great time, great cause. Again, you can check out all that information on our website every Friday night. Our free concert series, Las Olas Boulevard and A1A takes place, Friday night sound waves, so some great live music that you can enjoy, a very family friendly event, so if you are bringing the family down here to Lago Mar, uh, wave down one of those little beach hoppers, grab a little pedicab and come on down about a mile and a half. Uh, up the island from Lago Mar where you can enjoy that. We've got a stellar lineup starting this Friday with Afro-Cuban band Oriente. Uh, next week, Joel De Silva and Friends, a great blues night and closing out the month of April with one of our favorite South Florida performers, Valerie Tyson and her new project, the VTB Band. So great time here, but there's lots of music, lots to enjoy, tons of things going on. Again, Make sure to check out our website, myfortlauderdalebeach.com. You can even, while you're on Facebook, click on the events tab there. You can see some things streaming through and everything that you need to enjoy your stay here with us on Fort Lauderdale Beach. Again, want to thank everyone for joining us. Love having you here every Wednesday. Or special thank you to the general manager of Lago Mar, Jim Pancalo, for joining us, giving us a little behind the scenes, or I should say off the balcony tour of their backyard here at Lago Mar, but an exquisite property. So check out our page a little later on. We're going to post up some photos. Make sure to go on lagomar.com as well. You can learn all about this spectacular property and make this your stay when you are looking for that home away from home on Fort Lauderdale Beach. Thanks again, everybody. We look forward to seeing you next week. Hope you have a wonderful rest of the day, an absolutely wonderful rest of the week, and make it a great weekend, especially if you are here. Bye-bye.